Hello, and I'm here to talk to you about my research into bullying. Earlier this year, I created a research article for the journal Wiley and the ACP. The article was entitled, Is Person-Centred Counselling Effective When Working With Young People Who Are Experiencing Bullying in Schools? I gathered the research for this using the IPA model and obviously using qualitative methods. And what I found was, after doing semi-structured interviews and transcribing these, that there was a clear issue with person-centred counselling when working with young people experiencing bullying. Although person-centred counselling was effective for allowing the participant to explore the issues surrounding their bullying and incorporating issues of trauma, the participants all seemed to feel that there was not enough room for change with the person-centred approach meaning that they were still falling victim to the issues of bullying. They felt that although person-centred counselling is certainly effective and deserves its place within the counselling model, they would rather in future go with other research methods and other forms of counselling, such as the solution-focused approach or cognitive behavioural therapy, otherwise known as CBT. They also stated that they found the quantitative method may be more beneficial as it would show more participants who have experienced bullying and may not have had the best results with person-centered counseling. Thank you.